I commonly see patients that present to my room with a proposed bunion deformity. There is a common condition called hullux rigidus or arthritis of the big toe joint that can mimic bunion deformities. It more frequently occurs in men but can affect women also. There may also be a history of prior trauma to the area, although this is not always the case. Arthritis of the first MTP joint or big toe is called hullux rigidus, meaning stiffness of the big toe. An easy way to determine if arthritis is present is to determine whether or not there is lost motion or extension of the first MTP joint. Alongside stiffness of the joint, arthritis of the first MTP joint often results in a large bone spur formation on the dorsal or top aspect of the joint. This is felt as a bony prominence and may make shoe wear difficult. If you look down at your big toe and this is not angulated towards your second toe, but you have lost some motion of your first MTP joint with a large bony spur, then you may in fact have underlying arthritis of the first MTP joint. We also routinely arrange a weight bearing x-ray of your foot prior to your consultation to assess this. One of the important reasons to assess for any underlying arthritis on your scans is that your treatment options may differ. There are several great treatment options available for arthritis, although they do differ from the keyhole realignment procedure. I will of course discuss these with you on the day of your consult if it is relevant.